Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, another beautiful day. Temperatures getting up into the lower 80s this afternoon. Plenty of sunshine after a cloudy start early this morning. Live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar continues to uh, keep us uh, very dry. No precipitation to be found. And we've been talking about this now over the last several days, how we could use uh, some rain. We're at a bit of a drought here, at least a, a a minor one at that, but you know, the latest drought monitor just coming out in all of southern New England in the abnormally dry category. There are several tiers which goes all the way up to extreme and exceptional, and we are abnormally dry to borderline moderate in some spots. So, bottom line, we need the rain. The, in the short term and the long term, uh, we're running below average and really don't see a lot of precipitation over the next several days. Skies are sunny in Providence right now. The temperature at 80 on a southeast breeze at 13. There's your low humidity. It's hard to make moisture in clouds when you have this kind of humidity in place. Very dry air. Westerly, gorgeous down towards Musquamac Beach at uh, 76 degrees right now with some sunshine. You see showers and storms off to our south. We talked about this last night, how most of this would dive off to our south and miss us. But a couple of areas of low pressure, one and two, both staying to our south, but producing some severe weather. An outbreak right now of some strong thunderstorms, even the potential for some tornadoes and enhanced area of uh, severe weather. But again, staying away from New England as we stay on the dry side. We're getting real close. We'll walk you through it hour by hour starting off this evening. Obviously, it's a gorgeous uh, late day, early evening temperatures in the upper 70s. Overnight tonight, though, I do expect some extra clouds to be rolling in. So when we wake up tomorrow morning, it starts off cloudy, but give it time. The sun will win out 62 at 6 o'clock in the morning. Skies becoming partly sunny, though, during the afternoon. We're not in the low 80s, but rather mid 70s. So while these temperatures are still very pleasant, it is certainly cooler tomorrow compared to today. But overall, it's a great day to be outdoors. And by tomorrow evening, we are clear temperatures in the mid 60s. Your sunset time now, the longest days of the year. Right about now, 11 o'clock in the evening, partly cloudy and 65. Waking up to some clouds early in the morning. By late morning, becoming partly sunny. Temperatures starting off in the lower 60s. And then during the afternoon hours, uh, looking pretty good. Mainly sunny, dry and slightly cooler. High temperatures topping out in the mid-70s. Nothing has changed for Father's Day weekend. It still looks good. Dry with a warming trend on Saturday. Sunshine. We're looking at a temperature uh, at around 80. A gorgeous day. Activities uh, Saturday evening, Saturday night in Providence look fine. And on Father's Day Sunday itself, it's a little warmer, more humid, feeling more like summer. Beach, barbecue, golf. It is a go. 80s inland and 70s at the beach is really feeling like summer early next week. It's it's warmer and more humid. Next chance of any much needed rain, scattered showers and thunder, but not until Tuesday of next week with high temperatures in uh, the mid 80s. So that is a dad approved seven day future cast. Very nice. All right. Thank you, Tony.